Hey guys, what is good? Alrighty guys, what is good? Welcome to a new video. Before I start the video, I want to give you a warning. This video will be only me talking to you guys. I'm gonna explain exactly what the title says, how I will bulk, lean bulk. I will tell you step by step what I will do for my lean build. It is Monday, 5th of September 2016. I'm starting my lean build today. Also, before getting into the facts or numbers or anything else, I just want to give you a notice. I'm not an expert in nutrition and or training. So, before you experts out there give me any crap for what I'm saying, some stuff that I will say could be wrong, some stuff are good, but before you write a comment already, a notice, I'm not an expert. I don't have any degree in nutrition and or training, so please, please guys, don't give me crap if I say something wrong. I'm just a normal guy who has been lifting for three years, has fell in love with training health and just the lifestyle so it's Monday I'm gonna I'm gonna start my lean build today I won't really go in depth of nutrition or training I'm gonna keep it simple I have three points that I wanna talk about three simple points on how I will start my lean build and what I will do a lot of youtubers out there throw a ton of a ton of information to you guys but I'm gonna keep it simple I will tell you exactly what I will do and you can try it out on your own but everybody is different everybody has their own methods of bilking I'm gonna keep it simple I'm not gonna throw numbers at you throw facts because I'm not an expert I already said that I'm just a guy I have some experience a lot of people who watch these videos are just starting to get into lifting just starting to get into the lifestyle it's not necessary to throw a lot of information to you guys the more information you get the harder it will be for you so I'm gonna keep it simple I always say keep it at the basics I have my whiteboard here so it looks presentable it looks professional because I am a trained professional right so let's get to it guys I have three points first of all lean bulk alright lean bulk it's a method I'm gonna do I'm gonna use alright alright lean bulk lean bulk guys that's the thing I'm gonna do no but for real I have three points that I wanna talk about and I'm gonna keep it at that keep it simple so you guys know where I'm at, what my situation is. So first of all, you need to set a goal for yourself. I know my writing isn't the best. Hopefully you can read this. Let me get closer. So set a goal for, for yourself. That's the first thing you need to do. My goal with this lean build is to gain strength and mass. So my main goal with this lean build will be gaining strength and of course building muscle, building mass. I want to get as strong as I can. The muscle building, the mass will be just a part of that. Lifting heavy weights will of course lead to muscle mass. The goal, set a goal for yourself. My goal is gaining strength. That's the first thing done no matter what you're doing in life set a goal for yourself that's the most important thing because you need to have something to work on or to work towards the next thing after your goal set a plan for yourself plan it out guys after your goal you need to set a plan how will you reach your goal I'm gonna reach my goal which is gaining strength building a workout plan that will lead to gaining strength so I'm gonna set a workout plan my main focus will be bench deadlift and squat bench deadlift and squat I want them 
to go up. I want the numbers to go up. I want to hit new PRs. Not weekly, but I want to hit new PRs at the end of the build. This will be the main focus of gaining strength. And how will I do that? By doing compound movements, the bench, deadlift and squat. At first, 5 sets, 5 reps. That is one method of gaining strength. First, start with the compound movements and do 5 by 5 So that's my plan to reach my goal. Alright, I'm gonna keep it simple, short. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna work towards my goal, which is gaining strength by planning it out. Doing a workout plan focused on the compound movements, the bench, deadlift and squat. By doing a 5x5. Five five. That's already two things down, two points down. Keep it short today. Hopefully this will explain a bit of how I will start my lean build. I've got two of the three points already down. Let's clean this up. And the last and the most important thing of bulking, no matter what dirty bulk of lean bulk, of course will be calories. The calories will be the most important thing of a bulk. So the goal with a bulk is to gain weight. At the end the calories will tell you if you gain weight or lose weight. If you're in a calorie deficit you will lose weight. If you're in a calorie surplus you will gain weight. That is simple logic. Calories most important thing of a bulk. So, I started... No way! Fucking hell, mate! Listen to that! Close! Close the windows! It's war! What the fuck? <laughs> it's outside there. Damn! <laughs> That's scary, mate. Whoa, the helicopter! They're coming, they're coming! Get out of here, get out of here! Alright, I am back. I did not plan that out, guys. I did not, for real. Let's get back to it. This, this is more important, alright? Calories. <laughs> so, where was I? Calories is the most important thing in a bulk. It will say if you will lose or gain weight. So I'm starting today my lean build. I'm starting with the following macros. Nah, man. The black marker died, so I have a blue one right here. Where was I? The following macros I'm gonna gonna hit daily is 75 fat, 250 carbs, and 180 protein. Wait a minute, the same macros I had last week. Yes, you are correct. I'm gonna start the lean build with the same macros I ended my cut, I will say. It is more right here, mentally, I'm saying to myself, I'm starting the lean build. So I'm gonna keep the macros the same for one week. So I wanna gain weight, I'm gonna, I want to gain like 0.5 to 1 kg a week. That is my goal, I want to get like in between half a kilo to a kilo a week. At the end of this week, if I don't see any weight gain with these macros, I will increase increase the macros, the calories. My maintenance calories are probably probably at I think it's at 2700 calories maintenance. The past half year it has dropped a lot. So 27 is my maintenance calories. Adding these macros up together will be like 2400 calories so that's a 300 deficit. I won't gain weight, I will still lose weight this week so the next week I will bump up my calories by like 75 fat, 180 protein. I'm gonna have 300 carbs next week so that is 50 grams of carbs more than this week. That will be 200 calories so at the end of that week, the calories will be 2600. That's still 100 calories below my maintenance. And I will still lose weight. I will see at the end of these macros, at the end of the week, 
if I gain any weight or lose any weight and adjust my calories, my macros to it. If I lose weight again at the end of this week, I'm gonna bump my calories again. Before bumping it up, I want to say carbs are the most important thing of calories if you wanna build muscle. Carbs will build muscle. So like I said, I'm not an expert. This is all experience, this is all like from the past three years of training and eating and just experiencing on my own. I will bump up my carbs with 100 and go to 400. That's a hundred, that is a hundred grams of carbs extra. That is 400 calories. But, I'm gonna lower my protein to 170 and lower my fat by 5 to 70. So it will balance the amount of calories I bumped up. So I calculated the difference between the, these two macros and it is a 315 calorie difference. So at the end of this week I will be at 2915 calories. That is 200, 215 plus 215 surplus of my maintenance. The best scenario is to be like 200 to 400 surplus so 200 to 400 like in between that range you want to be in a surplus so at the end so to gain weight I need to be at so for me to gain weight I need to be at 29 and 3100 calories at the end of this week I will be at 2915 that is a surplus and that will that means I will gain weight if I do it correctly like I'm not sure if I will gain weight I will see at that point but if I calculated everything correctly I need to gain weight with these calories but I will again bump up my calories if I hit a plateau if I stay at one weight for a week or two I will bump up my calories but for now I need to get to this point and see what my weight does I won't go further into it because I don't know how I will react to these calories so I'm gonna leave it at this as you can see calories are the most important thing carbs of the calories focus your your main focus will be carbs so for fat it's like 20% of your daily calories and for protein it will be like let's say two times two times your body weight in kg for me it's 80 I weigh 80 kilograms now times 2 it's 160 but I'm gonna be sure and be safe I wanna hit 170 170 that is good for me I won't go higher than 170 that's not necessary I wanna focus on my carbs that is the main focus with the calories and macros fats you don't wanna go really high on fats because you will gain fat so main focus to building muscle is carbs. Like I said, I'm not an expert. This is by listening to other people and experience on my own. I can't tell you all the facts about carbs, what it does and that kind of stuff because I have, n I have no really in-depth knowledge on these kind of things. I just know by experiencing things. So that will include the video. Let's get rid of the whiteboard I said like three points the main focus will be calories of, of course also one more thing I'm gonna do I said I'm not gonna do any cardio but I've decided and I bought this jump rope yeah I'm gonna do every single morning 15 minutes of cardio just a really light jump roping and maybe some some shadow boxing. I will do that to boost my metabolism and maybe eat more food this way. So I'm gonna do cardio every single morning, 15 minutes, jump rope. I'm looking forward to that. Alright, that is pretty much everything I wanted to say. Now it's time. <sighs> Now it's time to gain weight, gain strength. So guys, set a goal for yourself, plan it out and calculate your calories. 
three simple steps. We are not really going in depth of it. So three simple steps, keep it at the basics. We are trekking. We could go and eat everything, let loose, but we are doing one thing good and that is positive. If you thought this was somewhat useful and you liked the video, please hit the thumbs up. Let me know in the comment section down below. Feel free to ask me anything. So until next time, ooh, gaining weight, we are gonna get this. You will see me change a lot, especially in the face. I will get a bloated face, big face. But until next time, until next video, I hope you have a really, really great day. Whatever it is in life, do what you want, guys. Life is too short. Live life. Peace.